Well, joining us this morning for today's health is Karen Donaldson. And if you're like many and you enjoy indulging in Valentine's candy this holiday, uh, she's here to tell us about one that you may f be able to feel a little less guilty about. And we are, of course, talking about the all-time favorite, chocolate. Chocolate. All right, so. I don't know if, it, <clears throat> if I've ever met anybody who doesn't like chocolate. I've met, I think, one or two. One. My wife's kind of not a big fan, but really? she loves sweets, so. So close. Close, exactly. And I had a lady one time tell me she was allergic to chocolate, and I thought, oh, that's so <laughs> sad. But then she confessed that she just told herself that so that she would stay uh, away from strategy. it. Strategy. That's strategy. That was her strategy. Okay. And then I blew it because she confessed that she really wasn't. So uh, it probably right. made her addicted again. <laughs> probably. <Yeah. laughs> well, all right, let's talk health benefits of chocolate. You've brought some different kinds here. I did. Uh, with you, so let's explain what we've got here. Yes. We've got milk chocolate, darker, more dark, and then and really, really dark. Really, dark, yes. And the darker the chocolate, the better. Um, chocolate has some antioxidants and flavanols in them that actually can help with cholesterol, blood pressure, heart disease, really a number of good health benefits involved with eating chocolate. Um, there have been studies showing that people who eat chocolate might have a lower BMI. I wrote about that okay. for the newspaper. And part of that is that maybe they know they love chocolate, and so they have the chocolate first instead of saying, oh, I'll have 10 other things first and okay. then have the chocolate. So they just committed to the chocolate and, and saved themselves a whole bunch of calories. But there are some really good health benefits to the chocolate as well. But again, it comes with moderation, right, too. Right, moderation So, key. like eating the entire chocolate bar this size every Probably night is probably not, not going to be a good idea. But having a small piece of chocolate on a daily basis, especially if that's something that you enjoy, can be good for you. So is this kind of like alcohol, like a glass, of, you know, they say a glass of wine right. a day is okay, but right. in excess, that's not as it's good It's a, a problem, exactly. Okay. And the only thing I would say about chocolate is that many, many people use it for a comfort food. And so if it really is a comfort food and you're seeking out chocolate for some emotional reasons, you do need to be careful because for a lot of people, once you start, it's really hard to stop. Like I could say, just eat one little piece and the person would say, okay, sure, that's fine. But then the whole candy one bar might be gone. Right, and it's not, it, it's something that goes on in their brain. So with people like that, you have to be a little bit cautious and just be aware whether you can just have one piece of chocolate or, or not. All right. So you mentioned uh, the coca. Uh, is it coca? Coco, yes. Okay, the coca count. So yes. this, um, the higher the better. This is 86 percent. Okay. And we're actually going to taste it because I'm a little bit afraid it isn't going to taste that good. Okay. I've never bought this high of coco percent right. before. Um, and then this one has 72 percent. And usually they'll advertise it right on the label, okay, so you'll know. They'll right? brag about it. A they'll little brag bit. about it most definitely. This one doesn't tell you what percent, so I'm guessing that maybe it's not as high, but it has coffee in it, so I think it's going to be pretty good. Okay. <laughs> so, and it's still dark. It says intense dark chocolate. And then the milk chocolate. And then the milk chocolate is only 31%. All right. So you can see that there's quite a difference. All Have right. you tried really, really dark chocolate before? Years ago, so yeah. let's try the really All dark right. one. And look at how pretty it's wrapped. So I'll they serve are this fancy. to you on this gold Thank you paper much. here. Yeah. So that one I'm expecting, is it gonna be a little bit bitter? It's more, it's kind of like chocolate chips, like straight mm -hmm. chocolate chips. Mm -hmm. so. Yes, that you would use for, uh, I don't like it. Yeah, it not much, but eh. I wouldn't have to worry I've about had, eating I've the had whole bar of this. We'll <laughs> exactly. So. All right, this is a 72%. This is dark chocolate oh. with almonds. Oh, we're, we're mm. <laughs> Greg's actually giving us the wrap sign. No, we'll we actually, have our chocolate to eat. We'll report <laughs> back on this we'll next time. We'll let you know here in a little bit. 